20 years ago, City Park looked very different than it does today. On August 6, 1997, a fierce windstorm blew through Kelowna, knocking over dozens of trees here in City Park and destroying boats at the Kelowna Yacht Club. Now, a more than 120-year piece of history from that day is looking for a new home. Clifford Bettman, who's a world-renowned artist, um, was basically commissioned to carve a sculpture. He actually took the largest tree that fell during the storm. When it was brought in, it weighed about three and a half tons. Uh, we figure that uh, it's dried out since then. It's actually in good shape, but we think it's still about uh, 6,000 pounds. We do consider it to be the largest cottonwood sculpture in the world. So it was pretty interesting bringing it in. We had to um, take the skylight off and dropped it in that way, and uh, here she sits. After residing in Town Centre Mall since 1999, it's time for a change of scenery. The owners of the mall have a lot of really exciting plans, and one of their plans is to basically uh, remove the interior uh, stairway here, remove the sculpture, and they're going to make kind of a common seating area. So just unfortunately, there's no room for the sculpture anymore. And we have to find a new home for it. Best case scenario is it stays in Kelowna. Uh, we'd love to see it in a public place so that the, you know, the public can continue to enjoy it. Uh, you know, something like an airport or something like that, but we're open to anything. Those interested in the sculpture can reach Perry at 250-861-8107. For Castanet News here in Kelowna, I'm Nick Johansson. Castanet has webcams, and lots of them. Click the cams button in our yellow masthead to see them all.